Thanks for watching Coffee with Pips. I do appreciate you stopping by and supporting my channel today. Okay, so today I'm going to be talking about Lou Melantes. Whoa, that's a mouthful. On their Chicago style pizza. What I'm going to do is I'm going to be reviewing the pizza on its consistency, the aroma, of course, the taste, the seasoning. You know, I heard a lot about this place and I want to, um, well, actually, I've heard about it a lot. Um, they've been around for a while. So I've never had a chance to go to it though and certainly have not had a chance to uh, evaluate their pizza. So I'm looking forward to it and um, we'll see what we got. Okay, so here we go. Oh. Well, it's got a plastic wrap on it. I'll probably be, oh with the steam. Okay, so that's what they have the plastic wrap on. It is carry out. Look at that steam. I hope you can see it. Okay, so I'm ready to put the first piece of my delicious, which I hope is delicious pizza. Okay, they cut it for me. They recommended that um, I cut it at home because it keeps the heat in, but I, well, I don't have a pizza cutter, okay. Okay. Nice, delicious pizza, pizza. Well, I keep saying it's delicious, but I haven't tried it yet. Wow, okay, that's really, that's really steamy. And this uh, pizza, deep dish pizza with um, spinach. They have all kinds of, uh, um, variety of uh, pizzas. However, um, I like to get spinach. You know, I need my strength there. Uh, get going back to a uh, regular work week on Tuesday. Mmm. This is so hot. Wow. It's very good. I heard a lot about the uh, crust. It is. It looks like... Um, it looks like a pie. So it's like they actually go like this to it. So it's um, all homemade. There we go. Let me just put this down and... Oh, I'm shaking. It's just so hot. I'm so excited, I guess. Flaky. Definitely can tell it's homemade. I've had... um deep dish pizzas at other places and um so far sorry Gino's um they're already at least a point ahead of you here. Hmm. I feel bad that you can't come and join me. But you can if you go to Lou Malnati's. I my little cheap sheet there I had to uh, um, write it down phonetically because that's a mouthful. Lou Mal Nadis. Yeah, there I said it. This is delicious. Okay. Sauce is chunky. There's enough seasoning. Chunky tomatoes. And then the spinach underneath. The consistency is really good. The um, Oh, there you go. If you don't like spinach, then they, like I said, they have other, um, a, a big variety of pizzas. I'm just a spinach eater. Look at that. Mmm. Okay, I'll stop. It's hard to stop and supposed to be reviewing this, right? Okay. Okay, so I drove past this place the other night and it was jam-packed. I was supposed to do this a couple nights ago, but like I said, it was just jam-packed. They have curbside pickup and uh, I got to experience it uh, uh, today. And uh, luckily there weren't a lot of cars today. Um, I was in spot 19. 
Okay. One more bite. Okay, I, I, I do apologize. Um, Using my fingers? No, really, I don't. I do. I don't. And there we have the crushed tomatoes. I'm surprised I would like it this much. Like I said, I had, um, I'm not here to compare, um, this is not a pizza challenge. This is um, my uh, true evaluation of a deep dish pizza. But I can see why they call it Chicago's favorite deep dish pizza. So I've had Gino's East, and um, it's good. However, this seems more authentic to me, and I'm really surprised because it's a, um, I have a lot of stores. So to keep that consistency, they have 56 stores right now, 56 locations in Illinois. Lincolnwood was their first store uh, when they opened in 1971. They have four in Arizona, two in Wisconsin, and two in Indiana, so it's uh, 64. Okay, so I'm real um, excited to see their Lincolnwood store once we get past all this uh, COVID and all the issues that we're having out there. I wanna be able to step a uh, uh, foot uh, in the original store. It's only a stone's throw away from my house, Lincolnwood, Illinois. It's awesome. Okay, some other facts. The price wasn't bad. It was uh, $19 for a medium, which I'll tell you, uh, it's heavy. <laughs> okay, so it's a medium, and um, I'll tell you, I'm, if it was only me, I'd be eating on it for uh, an entire week. I can tell you that because it's um, it weighs a ton. But it's not only me, so unfortunately, I'm going to have to make my way back there because I'll tell you, I really do honestly like this pizza and i think you will too i was like i said i'm surprised okay so they do ship uh their pizzas so uh you can go right down to the link i put a link to their uh website right below and um look at their uh menu and decide what you want to order um you can give them as gifts. They have different gift baskets i noticed on uh, um, or packages that i noticed on the website I'll be doing it for sure, definitely. Okay, so there you go for Luminati's. Lou, look at this. Lou Malnati's. I had to write it out phonetically because that's a mouthful, just like this pizza's a mouthful, and I'm excited that I had the opportunity to do it today. I hope you enjoyed this review, and I hope you come back for more. Thank you for watching Coffee with Pips. I appreciate it. Please subscribe.